Good morning. How are you doing? So you're com I'm coming live from Alabama Hills. Very beautiful here. 14 days, half a month. I'm going to see if I can stay here the whole time. I'm not until I figure out what I'm going to do with my game plan. So I'm gonna, like, there's Dharma, my beautiful chariot, my fire pony, and my... She looks like such a badass now. Like a RoboCop or something. Hmm. Cyborg, if you put a car, so can't be a cyborg. Anyway, walk with the dog. So my beautiful paintings I plan on selling. Yay! Little stack of them. And there's my latest. Baby. What's up? Grapes, kind of traditional. Yeah, it is what it is. So that's what it, the colors I use in the background spoke grapes, so I went with it. <clears throat> anyway. Um, I wanted to talk about something real quick. <clears throat> I have a confession. I'm a Californian. Not really popular nowadays. A lot of assholes. But, but Californian, yeah. Family's been there for over 100 years. 1870s, we've had a ranch. So yeah, we were here when it was an actual country before it became a state. So that's how long my family's been in California. Reminds me of somebody in our, my past that I really admired. Not Robin Hood, but Zorro. California's Robin Hood. We need Robin Hood. We need Zorro. My back's kind of messed up right now, so from that accident, but you know, somebody needs to don that mask, right? People in charge are dark hearts. They don't care about the people. People should be a priority. And any official that stands up and says, vote for me. Well, yeah. They're all losers. But the people are suffering because of it. Which is the worst part. And the news isn't going to cover it because they're all scum. They're corporate bought and sold. Globalists. So they're not going to make their, their current puppet look stupid. Er, than he already does. But, you know me, I'm trying to get pol political because next thing you know, I won't have any videos. This is probably why I'm already censored because I've already said how I feel about people. Globalist, dark arts, <clears throat> and all the fun stuff I've talked about, like aliens and Nazis in the Antarctica and fun stuff like that. But look at my videos. There's some cool ones, like when the, the puppy that met Bigfoot, that was a good one. I thought that was funny. Anyway. But yeah, I want you to have a wonderful day. I want you to love yourself because that's important. That's the key. That's the key to your success, to your happiness, your freedom, your mental enslavement. Your chains are broken the minute you love yourself, the minute you truly care more about yourself than other people do. Because, you know, here's the thing. People that usually are suffering are the ones that love everybody more than themselves and they usually end up getting drained or abused and used. Because nobody gives a shit about them. But they're too busy giving a shit about everybody else to care about themselves. Those are the ones that need to love you. You need to love yourself. You need to say, take a break from wiping everybody else's butt and just love you. That's it. Just love yourself. Once you love yourself, you'll never be put in positions. You'll never be put in situations where you'll let people take advantage of you. Some guy wants to put you in a room and wants to take advantage of you so you can get a job. No, no. You kick him in the nuts and you walk out and you say, I can, go, I can get a job somewhere else. Thank you very much. That's how life is. You gotta stand up for yourself. You gotta love yourself that much. That's how life works. Anyways, I love you, and God loves you, and the universe loves you. So yeah, you got something to build on. <laughs> anyway, I love you. Have a wonderful day. No, I keep rambling. Anyway, there's Dharma. I love you, Dharma. There's some rocks. Cool. Okay, have a wonderful day, people.